hello everyone in this video i am going to show you how you can search any selected text in google from any location with this uh, google Street project if we need to search uh, any selected text uh, with google uh, manually we just need to copy it and paste it into the browser for an example if i need to search uh, uh, this selected text this particular text i just need to copy it and i need to go into my browser and i need to paste and uh, press enter to uh, see the results right but uh, with this project we can do it automatically with the keyboard shortcut for an example by default this one uh, defines this uh, keyboard shortcut control uh, plus f2 so we just need to select any text and uh, press control uh, and f2 to uh, open the google search you just need to install xclip first uh, we need this xclip to get uh, this script working properly after that you can uh, clone the repository and get this script into your computer then you can enter into that uh, project directory and install all the dependencies uh, required finally you can start the script like this after that this script will uh, listen all the keystrokes and uh, if there is a keystroke matching this uh, defined uh, keystroke it will uh, google the selected text automatically so now i will show you how it works so i already installed dependencies and all the uh, required setup and script also so I'm going to start the script uh, like this. Since we are listening into keystrokes, we just need to use sudo command as well. Now we can see the Google Sri uh, script is started and uh, we, it is listening to this uh, keystroke, the combination of keystroke. So this will work everywhere. Uh, for an example, if you are working with uh, uh, terminal program let's say we get some error like this if we need to google this one we just need to select this one you can select uh, this one by dragging the cursor or you can dou double click to select all the things then you can uh, press ctrl f2 right then it will automatically uh, search the selected text uh, with google this will work inside the browser as well if we select this one and press uh, ctrl f2 so it works right it will work with any uh, uh, application with the uh, code editors as well if you need to search this selected text press ctrl f2 then it works so now we can check uh, how it works basically so all the script uh, contents uh, can be found in inside this main.python file so it uses uh, several libraries clipboard uh, keyboard and os uh, uh, likewise there are several uh, libraries are used in uh, this particular script file so there is a class called google tree so very first uh, we are creating an instance of this uh, class so inside the class we can see several uh, methods so first of all we are going to call this register hotkey method with the keyboard shortcut then we can look into the register hotkey so basically it will register the hotkey using the uh, keyboard library add hotkey method so now the uh, the hotkey is registered and uh, now we are having importantly a callback so this callback will be triggered whenever there is a uh, matching keystroke so inside the callback uh, if a uh, user pressed uh, that uh, uh, particular keystroke this uh, uh, key combination so uh, this callback will be triggered now we are using xclip to get the selected text and we have the selected text inside this variable so after that we are reusing the same variable and uh, we are putting the url encoded uh, text so because uh, we can select any uh, text with these spaces as well so if for an example if i select uh, this particular text and uh, press ctrl f2 so this URL should be a uh, URL encoded, right? So that's why we are using this uh, code plus method from uh, URLib. After that, uh, we are launching the browser. Now we are using the Google Chrome browser and we are opening new tab. So we are just uh, using Google URL and a Q parameter and we are putting the uh, URL encoded text here. So that's about the hotkey callback method. 
so this listen method will be triggered uh, eventually so this in this uh, listen method uh, very first it will print a uh, nice uh, ascii text and after that it will uh, print the some message uh, in the current hotkey then it will uh, start the keyboard loop this is kind of a while loop uh, capturing all the key strokes so that's how this basically works so as i mentioned uh, you can follow these steps to install uh, this uh, particular uh, uh, script into your computer and also you can this uh, and also you can start uh, this uh, script automatically with the computer startup so see you in next video